Hawks are birds of prey and fly at amazing speeds. The red-tailed hawk, for example, can fly at speeds exceeding 190 km per hour. But for the Republic of Singapore Air Force, the hawk stands for something that flies more than 15 times faster. I hawk missiles, the guardian of our skies. Fire Unit Commander Captain Clarence explained to me that Singapore is guarded in terms of concentric circles. Our first line of defence is our fighter aircraft. But if that fails, the next line of defence will be our IHOC missiles with a range of 40 kilometres. To find out how these missiles get deployed, I followed them on one of their deployment exercises. These exercises ensure the operational readiness of the Air Force's defence umbrella that operates on a 24-7 basis. The vehicles you see here are all part of the convoy that plays a part in the firing of the missiles. Wanting to see for myself how the missiles are loaded, I first checked out the launches. We work in a team of four, which consists of two crewmen, one crew chief and one driver. So the driver, under the guidance of the crew chief, will guide the loader to transport the missile from the trailer to the launcher, or vice versa. I'm the crewman, I'll be the left and the right eye of the crew chief in guiding the loader to the launcher. I then visited the brains of this setup. This is the control centre where Captain Clarence gives the order for his men to engage the target. 05407. Okay. Mark 1 Roger, press the bus stop 270 type 5 Control Mike 1, I'll be advised one bus stop at 260 20. Mike 1 Roger, clear engage bus stop now. 